Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Soli Pones and welcome back to my Tamadachi life. Let's play before we get started Do me a huge favor and click on that like button for me. It really helps me out a lot Anyways today we are gonna be exploring this island. Hopefully we have new people that fell in love It doesn't look like it yesterday We had Mario who fell in love with Peach and he's still depressed because of that because Peach rejected both him Luke and she ended up going with Rodri and for that I should have kicked her off the island But you know, I guess a lot of people would really be upset if I did even though a lot of people hate Peach Like at least for those of you who want let's 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 have a vote right now If you like Peach say you like Peach and if you hate Peach say you hate Peach and let me know know why because I'm very intrigued personally I hate peach because you know she's the one that that likes getting around on the island and and likes leading on other people and I don't know I'm pretty sure her and Rodri aren't even gonna work out in this game but look at this we have Mo's little baby here at the fountain look at him every time I confuse him for Mo it's just because his hair is brown that's what makes me realize that it's not actually Mo because Mo has black hair in this game. Um, actually, he kind of he kind of does have black hair in real life. But we have space food as the new food of the daily special. We're gonna go ahead and buy one of these because why the heck not? Eat space food. Step two, go to space. At least step one is easy. Actually, step two is pretty easy as well. I gotta figure out how to give myself a lot of money in order to go to space. But you know, I'm actually gonna hit up the pawn shop first and sell everything that I have, and then I'm gonna try to go to space today. Because a lot of you guys want to see that and you know, I also want to see that it's something that I've wanted to do before I ended off this LP even though we still have quite a bit of episodes to go before this LP comes to a complete end I still want to uh, be able to do this before uh, so that way, you know We could maybe do it again in the future, but then that would cost us another ten thousand dollars maybe if I were playing this game for like for the past month, even though I wasn't recording, if I continued to play it and just collect the donations, it would have been much better because then I would have been able to accumulate a lot of money because every day, I think I make like $250 off of donations, so... I think that's, that's about a good $6,000 a month, if I'm correct. That's not including the money that I make off of playing video, uh, off of playing games with my people or giving them clothing or new interiors or just feeding them. Or selling stuff. I mean, you, there's lots and lots of different ways to make money in this game. And look at that. We have we have a couple new outfits here. This is really cool. This baby chick suit. I'm going to buy that. Man, I'm being really terrible with money. But you know what? It's okay because that baby chick suit is amazing. And somebody's going to wear it. And they're going to give me back more than what I spent on it. Which is good. Um, and let's... Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else. Let's actually check out the interior. There probably won't be anything else besides, yeah, the Halloween. It's only for this month. I'm probably going to buy that eventually. And then there's this the frontier sunset. It's just you and your own wagon out in the middle of nowhere Beware of rattles rattlesnakes is what I'm assuming they mean, but that's okay Let's go ahead and check out the me news and see what's going on today on Molly Island You're watching me news Luigi had his birthday today Here's some live footage of the birthday celebration from Molly Hotel La 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 dear Luigi. La 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 la. Congrats. Congrats. Thanks. We asked some islanders for their thoughts on the matter. Well, good for them. Hope it's a great year for Luigi. Thanks for watching. For your 3 o'clock me news, this is Christian Ruiz, signing off. Dang, it was Luigi's birthday today. I wouldn't have known that unless it was from me news. Because that's the stupid thing. Like, they should... I don't know. I feel like if if you have so many people added on the island, they should, like, make their window special when it's their birthday. But they don't do that. So it makes it very hard to indicate whether or not it's someone's birthday. And it looks like, ooh, Clarissa wants to become friends with someone. I thought she was going to be in a fight with someone. But that's not the case. Her and Mo seem to be all lovey-dovey and whatnot. And let's see... Yeah, we haven't seen each other in, like, almost a freaking month. That is intense. All right, so she's very happy with Mo. Her good pal is Isaac, which is her baby, and then Aaron's her best friend. Oh, they want to go on a date. All right, how about... 
She's taking Mo on on a date. Get that? She like that's Mo is not. He, Mo sucks at dating. He sucks at relationship. All right, let's have him go out at the uh, uh, the cafe maybe. All right, I get, do we get to watch them go out on a date? I mean, we've never ever seen this before. We've oh oh oh, we do get to watch them. Okay, cool. Oh no, we don't. All right, let's go ahead and hit locate. Uh, she's just standing there. You're not actually inside the cafe. Maybe the cafe is closed and she can't go inside to get food or whatever. I don't really know, but Peyton here wants to play a game. We could play a game with Peyton and make some extra money before we make our way to space because we are going to have to, you know, accumulate lots and lots of money in order to do that. Hopefully I could give myself space, um, the space food and I'll like it and then I make money off of that. But here we go. Oh, yeah. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Push her off. Yes, she's close. There we go. I win. Thanks. Thanks for your money, sucker. <laughs> awesome. I'm not even sure how much money I'm going to get off of that. But, you know, I could also make extra money by feeding people on the island. Just going around feeding them. I don't know if I want to do that, though. Like, that's, that's some intense work. That's going to take a while to do. And Peyton also has an issue, but... We're gonna play games first, like with Ganondorf, for example. Ganondorf, we haven't really interacted with him. He's probably, yep, still level one. Because, you know, we hardly ever play with Ganondorf. Um, just because, you know, he's he's Ganon. Here's your first you only want to fight him in Zelda, and that's about it. Alright, so this is the, uh... uh whoa. That's definitely Brock. Luke's not that brown, and Clarissa's a girl, so... Brock. The second Pixel Islander is going to be Mask Salesman. He's the only one with those really profound cheekbones that just suck into his face. They're absorbed into his face. And the final Pixel Islander will be... Oh, man, that's definitely Christian. Aaron has blonde hair. I am brown, and Christian is the guy with the long black hair. So they made it very easy for us today. Now I just stole Cannon's money, except I didn't really steal it. He's happy that I won. It's like, how how come you're happy? Like, you're giving me free money. Oh, and a gift. What did I get? I got a snow globe. Wait, no, he doesn't give you money? Are you kidding me? So when it's like... What? Are you saying if I play a game that involves... Like, me... Versing someone else, for example, like the card game, and if they lose, they're upset, they give me money because we're gambling with each other. That's pretty much what they're trying to tell us. Like, gambling's okay. Alright, what do you want, Abdallah? Alright, man. I have lots of hats for you, buddy. What about... We've given him the bandana. We've... we've Actually, I don't even know if I've given him a bandana. We have so many hats, though. Here, I have this striped wool hat in blue. If he doesn't like it, I'll just continuously give him hats until he likes one, and then I just make money back. Yeah, he liked it, so I'm gonna make some money back from it. Not as much as I spent on this hat, I'm pretty sure, but, you know, that's okay. At least he liked this hat. It's nice and green and whatnot. Let's see Reggie doing push-ups. He married to Rosalina yet? Reggie is still not married, but he's always been wanting to get married to Rosalina. It's been like a month and they still haven't gotten married, which is very sad. Oh, you also want a hat? Okay, buddy. I'll give you a hat. Uh, oh, no, that's not where I want to go. I want to go into that. He wants a very unique hat. Something that you wouldn't find anybody else wearing. Uh, what about... Oh, what about that? I mean, that would go really well with his suit that he's wearing. Maybe Reggie doesn't have his sense of fashion. Oh, he he really likes that hat. Okay, cool. I knew he would. I mean, that hat goes good with anything you wear. And I gained some money off of that, which is good. It's always good to make some extra money off of just stuff that you were already going to give to them. And then let's check out what Peyton wants. She's probably going to either say she's hungry or... Nope, she wants a hat. I swear to God, if you want a hat, man... It's gonna be so weird. Oh. All right, let's go I ahead and do this, guys. If you ever get a strange letter telling you to meet up on the roof, don't ever do it. It's not safe. This is not Tamadachi life. But we're doing this because we want to see who's the creeper that sent Peyton a letter. If it's Luigi again, I am so done with this. Oh, it's Tiffany. You could already tell by her long hair, her bunny ears. Just makes it so obvious that it's Tiffany. 
but she's gonna be wearing like glasses or something to make yep and a mustache well wow, I, I can't tell who you are what did Peyton do oh my god did she kill someone <sighs> what did Peyton do is she gonna confess now that was Tiffany. It was pretty creepy, but I'm still glad I went. Is are they implying that Tiffany stalks Peyton? That's pretty much what they're implying. Tiffany stalks Peyton so she knows what she did. And that she, she did something very bad apparently. But Lazzie yeah, here is hungry. We could so feed her, you know, some food. How about How about some salami? Sashimi is her favorite food currently, but we'll feed her some salami and she loved it nice You know, I actually give her another dose of salami You can have another batch of salami. It's okay. What is that sewing machine? Not bad I would never ever use a sewing machine after watching Carrie and Annabelle like I would never bring myself to use one of those Those are just like I don't know wait she'll pass on the salami really but don't you love salami and aren't you still very hungry? All right, have some of that. What about this? Maybe their tongues are adapt to like having savory food, then sweet, then savory, then sweet. Oh, she loved that too. Not bad. So she levels up to level five and I gained money off of that. Not bad at all. 20 bucks, really? That's all I get? All right, here, have a CD. You could... You could pirate a game and put it on it. Okay. I guess that's it for you. I mean, oh, she can actually listen to it. What's she using it on? An actual, what? How do you insert a CD in that? Are you kidding me? Are you serious right now? All right, so Kaylee and Dante got in a fight. We're gonna go ahead and see what they fought about before we make our way to our little friend Mario and give him a travel ticket to travel the world. Cause that's probably the only and most efficient way to get rid of somebody's depressive mood. Um, okay, how about you make up? Please help me calm down first. Um, okay. Uh, what about if I fed you a milkshake? You're pretty hungry, aren't you? So milkshake would probably hit the spot just right. Yeah, there you go. She loved it. Well, I'm on a good streak today. Like, I'm actually... Is she not gonna give me money off of this? Are you... Are you for real right now? And if she gets, oh man, if you get rejected, I'm so done. I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna go straight to Mario's apartment. She better not be rejected by Dante. Just apologize and forgive each other and kiss and then move on. I'm sorry about what happened. I'm sorry too. Come on, do it, do it, please. Say it, yes, I know you got it. Say it, it's on your tongue. Oh, he's I'm not gonna. Not over I it. freaking knew it. I freaking knew it. Now she's gonna be depressed. Oh my God, really? Things didn't go, so at least we can watch why they got in a fight and why Dante's still not over it. Clearly, she did something to really upset him. All right, let's just find out what happened. I'm not gonna feed you. We didn't patch things up at all. All right, can I can I see what happened? All right, cool. You throw like a weirdo. She kind of does. He kind of does. Like a weirdo. Wow, nice. You just stole his insult. Like a wow, you just stole each other's insults. Very clever. You're more. Dang, what did you do? Why you little? Oh. You monster, you. Why you little monster, you? Just give up already. For serious. For s what? Why would I give up when I'm winning? This is so weird. You're obnoxious, Dante. It just shows them fighting, and why are they to throwing diplomas at each other? Like, who the heck would have a diploma or a certificate like that? You guys are still young. Get over yourselves. Alright, Tiffy B wants to be friends with someone. If it's Peyton, I'm- Actually, no, this is the- This is the real Tiffany, not the fake one. Hey. Hello. How's it going? I heard that Cole wants to be friends. Sure, you can be friends with Cole. Great idea. Not bad. Do it. Okay. Her and Cole are going to become best of friends. Cole is a very special individual here on the island. He likes to dress up as a girl from time to time. He's kind of fruity, which is okay. You know, we're not here to discriminate. 
Tiffany was a little surprised when she saw him in the dress, you know, as anybody else would, because he has that Kobe afro going on for him. At least they work things out, you know, they're, they're, they're going to be friends and whatnot, and that's, that's really all that matters right now. It went great. You're friends now. You're welcome, Tiffany. You're very welcome. Here, I want you to have this. She's pretty hungry. You know, I should probably give her a milkshake. Dude, I could use- I- thanks, you knew I was sick, so I'll take that cold medicine right off your hands and give it to me. Alright, you drink that milkshake. Mmm. And she loved it. Very nice. So now she's full. She almost leveled up. She's friends with Cole, and we made some money off of that. And she wants to play a game, so now hopefully I can make some more money off of her. It's like, if they could give you money for- for stuff like that, then why don't- Why- I don't- What's the point of pocket change? That's gonna be Belle. It's not Luke or Luigi. It's definitely a girl. I knew it. Next off, that is going to be Reggie Fizame. Reggie. Nice. The last one is... Why'd she wink? That is... That is Zelda, I think. The correct answer is it's not Tiffany. Zelda, Tiffany doesn't have blonde hair like that. It's definitely Zelda. Zelda. To totally Zelda, man. Very easy. Very easy peasy lemon squeezy. You did it. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, and what did I get? I got a plastic trophy out of this. I went through all of that just to get a plastic trophy, which is okay. You know, I'm not going to complain about a plastic trophy. A trophy is a trophy. Ariel has a problem. I actually want to find Luigi's apartment really quickly. There he is. We could go give him a happy birthday present. And, you know, make sure he's doing alright. How's it going, Luigi? It feels like forever since I last saw you, Sally's It's around. weird how he has a girl's voice, but that's okay. Uh, here, I'll give you a present, man. Uh, I don't really have much, but... But I'll give you something like uh, a new interior. Like, here, have this English garden interior. You know, happy birthday to you, Luigi. I hope you had a fulfilled 30-something birthday. Thanks for the amazing new interior. I love it. All right, ni nice. Want to take a look around? Sure, we can take a look around. Look at that. Luigi now lives in a garden with a nice wagon right there. With the I can see myself living happily here. I mean, it is a pretty nice garden, man. Not a whole lot going into it, but still. A change of scenery he could sleep on the floor. That's fine. Now, do I get money? Yes! The best part about this game is collecting. Collecting money. So, I could successfully say that hopefully in tomorrow's episode, I'll be able to make my way to outer space Welcome. and feed myself the uh, delicious space food that I have. But, you know, I'm gonna sell all this stuff right here. And now I have a total of $2,883.50. Uh, and I think I have like approximately 9,000 something in my, uh, my, what's it called? My inventory. So, or at least in my pocket change or my bank. I don't know. With my, me look like has a lot of money to be able to go to space. So we don't really need to use all of this money that we have currently. But hopefully in the next episode, we'll actually make our way to outer space. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like. And I will see you guys in the next episode.